Yo, what up? Morning. Got these skates here that I'm customizing right now, and this is the finished product of one of them. Size 8, Solomon ST8. Um, so yeah, if you remember, these have a one-piece sole that are actually on here. But uh, I managed to cut them off and put on UFS frames. So that is my final outcome. My favorite skate. This was what got me into rollerblading. And I, I just couldn't bear with somebody not using these skates. So I'm, I'm setting these up as an extra pair for somebody to ride if they ever come over and be like, hey, let's go rollerblading. I don't have any skates. Well, I got some for you. So what I've done is um, I've taken the ST8. I sawed off the frames. I marked where I'm going to be putting the UFS bolts and I just got to drill them in there. Might want to take out all the accessories. Seems to be a good fit. Um, I have these UFS bolts here um, that I will be using. So, but this is my first time actually UFSing. This will be my first time UFSing a pair of skates. I was gonna originally just sell these frames and get rid of them. But um, it's more worthwhile to just put them to use on some skates here. So the UFS connector just goes in there like any other skate. Probably needs to get squeezed in a bit more. And now I can put this on here that but you just got to make sure that the frame goes on straight and that's my biggest area of concern right now so I'm gonna mark there's that one for this to go on straight yeah this is straight as it's gonna get it might not be perfectly straight keep dropping everything here it's tough because I didn't make the line straight <laughs> when I cut the sole plates. But I think it should work. Just gonna make one more drill here. All right, just gonna put this last piece in here. I did cut my finger doing this today. Great. Just gotta put in the screw and we're all done here. get the wheels in and voila we've got it now on a skate that was non UFS that is now UFS making sure that they're equal pretty good I don't think that they're perfect in the way that everything lines up in terms of the frames but it's damn pretty close. I'm just gonna put my, I took out the Solomon shock absorbers for my skates. Uh, I'm using these Aeon shock absorbers in these ones. Yeah, I put the Aeon. I took out my Aeon shock absorbers and replaced them with Solomons. I just love the Solomon shock absorber. It's like the best thing. The best shock absorber ever created on the market. There it is. No way will these fit me to skate them, so I can't ride these, but I'll try and get somebody on them to test them out. Ah, whatever, it's all good. But come on though, look how sexy these skates are. These skates, so sexy. Who would, who would wanna ride these? I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep them. I might sell them for like a hundred bucks. 
hundred something dollars if anything but these skates are what got me into rollerblading I always wanted these skates from the movie Brink that was on Family Channel all the time when I was a kid he had these skates in the very opening scene I always wanted them so when I actually found these skates for free someone was donating them to a thrift store and this I come by pick them up on my driveway they're in a box so I picked them up and I I was about to sell these frames the other day. I'm like, I'm just gonna put these frames on these Solomons and make the ultimate power blading setup, vintage styles, for somebody to wear. Somebody, anybody wants to come rollerblading? Hit me up. It's got some size eight, size nine skates to wear. We can go hit the streets. Now, um, I do have other setups besides those Solomons. Uh, those Solomons aren't even mine to really ride or for friends. Um, I do have another pair of Solomons that I ride occasionally that are custom. Let me get them. Um, these being another classic Solomon hard boot. The first UFS Solomon of its kind. Um, Aaron Feinberg Pro model. Um, I was a huge fan of these when I was a kid. Um, I actually never owned a pair of these when I was young. I, I actually liked the soft boot Solomons a lot more. Solomon ST92, um, Solomon STI, like those are my favorite Solomon skates. Um, but these ones, I saw them at the thrift store for 10 bucks and I'm like, I have to get them because they're $10. And what I did was um, I modded it so I can put USD7 soles on here. I just don't have a frame system on here right now. Um, I like to ride flat rocker, which is eight down, eight wheels. Um, and I just don't have a frame system for these at the moment, but I am working on these right here. Um, they're the Sebas. And uh, again, I have the USD seven sole plates put on them here, um, USD seven soles, but uh, I have these frames I'm, I'm working on. They're called Wish US, otherwise known as OIC. <laughs> um, these guys can fit up to 72 millimeters on the outsides, and then 60 mil on the inside, or 59 mil on the inside, creating a flat setup with a huge H block, way bigger than what the Aeons offer. So in order to get these 72 wheels to fit, you have to Dremel sole plate down here because it needs a groove it needs a dwelling for the wheel like a hub for the wheel to spin so I just finished doing that um, the only thing I'm, I'm missing is a pair of 59 millimeter wheels that's gonna go in the middle I'm picking those up tomorrow um, but for the meantime I'm just gonna put these frames together right now and I'll show you how the, the skate looks I'm actually super stoked to be rocking these skates again. Um, I feel like they will protect my ankle more than the Aeons have been. Um, but this is the setup as anti-rocker. Um, these frames aren't designed to be skated anti-rocker though. So um, yeah, that's not gonna happen here. But um, When I get the full setup going together tomorrow, I, I will make a video on these and a full out review. But uh, until then, that's all my skate setup that I have going on right now. Uh, the Aeons are in the car. I will be doing a full out review on the USD Aeons for like my one year with them. Uh, but otherwise, keep on skating. Oh, shit. Oh, day. Pray them niggas go away. Oh, we sell the album either.